so I've just set up the altitude tent and Krista, my girlfriend, is not happy at all. Hello, Krista. Hi. <laughs> do you want to smile for the camera? No. <laughs> what do you think of my, uh, I think it's my, ridiculous. my, my altitude tent? I think what's, it's just ridiculous that you're doing this the night before you're actually, you're leaving and you've only got one day until you get there. So uh, this is the night before my uh, two nights before the triathlon, and I've had to come back to London. So I'm now missing all my altitude training by living up in the Alps for three days beforehand. Um, so I managed to give some people a quick call uh, in Putney. They're called the Altitude Centre, and they have lent me this altitude tent for 24 hours. It won't make a huge difference to me, but it's a good thing for me to experience and I think it will give me a chance just to get a little bit of a feel for it. So I've set up the tent and I'm going to sleep in it. I've got an interval session to do for an hour, um, which is just taking the mask, uh, to the, holding it on the, on the face for five minutes and then taking it off for five minutes and you, you ramp up the volume uh, quite a bit more on the machine, which is just out here. Sounds like a little bit of a hoover. Um, that's sucking up all the oxygen, filtering it, taking it out, and making it uh, situate a bit similar to out the Alps in terms of oxygen levels. So I'll just give you a little look. This is what I have to get in. It takes 40 minutes to get set up. Little zips on the side down here, and then that's what I'm sleeping in. Uh, I don't think, uh, I think I'll be sleeping in here on my own. Uh, I don't think Chris will be too too happy. Um, I think I've pushed the, uh, the the boundaries a little bit on this one, setting it up in the house. Um, I don't think it, the uh, the interior design aspect of Chris is too happy. Um, but uh, yeah, I'll see how I get on and uh, let you know what the, uh, the evening and the, the night was like. Cheers, bye.